Hey guys, Ramya here with YouTube Nonprofits, and today I'm excited to announce two new features for YouTube Nonprofit Partners. And the first is the ability to select custom thumbnails for your videos. So basically, if you have a video and the thumbnail happens to be an unflattering shot of your executive director or one of the three possible thumbnails just doesn't match the needs of your organization, you can upload any JPG file, any picture from your computer to replace it and represent that video. So now I'm going to show you how to capture a custom thumbnail. So you just go to your account. here and go to account and then you go to your uploaded videos and I'm going to add this to my previous video here a new custom thumbnail and then I would scroll down here and then see I don't really like these three thumbnails that are selected so I would go to upload a new thumbnail and I'd be able to select a picture um, any picture from my desktop so let's try this guy. And everyone loves adorable golden retriever puppies. That'll enable a high click-through rate. So I'll go to Save Changes. Thumbnail was successfully changed. And then you just want to make sure that you click Save Changes down here. And that's it. You've added a new custom thumbnail to your video. The second feature we're introducing is the ability to link to an external website right from your video using YouTube video annotations. And actually, a little while ago, consultant Michael Hoffman referred to this external annotation feature as um, a game-changing feature for nonprofits. And if you click here, you can actually go to that post that he wrote. Um, so this is similar to our call to action overlay feature, which we introduced in March, um, which creates a fixed overlay that pops up about a third of the way through the video and um, drives you to an external website. The cool thing about video annotations is that you can actually customize when and where on the screen your annotations appear. So I could put an annotation here or here or here. Basically, I can put them anywhere on the screen at any time. So that's what makes them a little bit different from the overlays. And then um, currently, anyone can use video annotations, um, but you can only link to a different YouTube video or YouTube channel. But for nonprofits, we're giving you the ability to drive traffic off site to a donation page or a sign up page, which is really cool. So now I'm going to show you how to create an external annotation in your video. So we're in the edit video screen here and I'm going to edit this video and add an annotation. Clicking annotations up here. Hey YouTube. I'm going to Since we started the YouTube pause this video. We've got a couple of different options in terms of the types of annotations you can add. You can add a speech bubble, you can add a note. So let's add a note. You can enter your text here. So check out my blog. And I'm going to change the color so it stands out a little bit more. You can make it a little bigger. You can move it around on the page. And most importantly, I can add a link. And so if you want it to go to an external website, you select external link. And then you fill in the link here. Citizen2.com. And this is a website that's not inside the YouTube domain. So I want it to show up immediately. So let's select that and click save and then publish. And then let's go up here and make sure that it worked. So let's go to introducing. Hey YouTube, since we started. And there it is. And when I click the annotation, it goes to citizentube.com. So if you want to take advantage of external annotations or custom thumbnails and you're in the nonprofit program, you can get started right now. And if you're not in the nonprofit program but meet the criteria, you can go and visit youtube.com slash nonprofits to apply now. And it's open to 501c3s in the United States and registered charities in the United Kingdom. So good luck, and please let me know if you're using these features because we can't wait to see what you do with them.